Today we will be discussing well test satellite. To locate the well test satellite, you can select the pull down menu in your well site display and select the well test satellite, or you can select this beaker icon and that will take you directly to the well test satellite. From here, we can see all of the tests that have been performed over the specific dates that I have already selected. So we can go in and change the date and let apply. We can also look at the status and narrow it down to accepted, rejected, calculating, validate, and failed tests. And once we have decided on that, we can select apply. Here, we can also export all of the reports that we have here by simply clicking the export and this will export it into an Excel file. There are a couple ways that you can look at the report. You can select the view test details here with the paper and magnifying glass, or you can select the location name on this page. From here, you can see the start date, the test time and hours, status, and so on. So I will go in and select this and here we can see the test record details. We'll have over on the left hand side we can see which location it's associated with as well as the location LSD is up here as well. We can see the status has been accepted and we can look at the comments that have been provided. Here we can see the test detail, the meter parameters, gas composition, the EMF meter information, snapshot of the flow calculations, because this was an accepted well test, we can also change this to rejected. If this was already rejected, we cannot change that. We can append the comments or we can click here for a test listing and go back to our initial site. Here we can also reject the test as well. Here, because it has not been accepted or rejected, we can accept by clicking on the green check mark or reject by selecting the red X. By selecting either one of those, we can add our comments into there and select accept for the comments to go into the notes. We can not change this to accepted. As you can see here, this is a rejected site and there is no option to further accept that or change that. Up top here, once if we're still selected on the entire satellite, we can look at the meter parameters. If we select that, we can go into edit if we'd like to change any of the values. We can go in and change whatever we would like as well as any of our measurements if we wanted to change that. We can change the start date. So for example, if you were to have changed some information yesterday but are updating it on Z-axis today, we can go back in and change the start date to yesterday. The change will be effect indefinitely, meaning that unless there is another time or you can select an end date. I'm just going to keep on selecting change will be indefinitely and the changes will be in effect if you select save. If you select cancel, no changes will be made. We can also look at the parameter history here as well, and we can go into the well manager. So from here, we can see all of our names of the locations at LSDs here. We can go ahead and edit them by simply clicking on this little pencil icon, and we can change the UWI if we would like, or the LSD. We can add comments if we'd like, and we can select save. I'm going to select cancel and as you can see this location name this came up. I'm going to go back to entire satellite and I'm going to go back into well manager and from here I can add test well. So if I wanted to add another site into this test well I can do that simply by adding the LSD or name I can search location for existing or I can create a new one. and. We're just going to leave that there. We can enter in the UWI here and any comments that we would like to make. Once again, select save or cancel to not save. If we select just the one location, we can select and see up here the gas compositions for just this site. Again, we can go ahead and edit. We can look at the parameter history for this site as well. Once again, we can go back in and look at our well manager. To run a location, to run a test, we would just go into one specific site and we can go into add well test. 
Once we have selected that, we can set the time and date. So we can select from today's date and it will go for 24 hours. We will go ahead and select that in here and then to the 19th. We can enter in our BSNW. We can enter in the solution gas factor if we need to, and we can add any comments. Once the comments have been added and all the information has been added, if I select save, the test will begin and run for 24 hours. I'm going to select cancel because I do not want to run a test at this time, but once the test is running, the status will come up and say calculating. If you have any further questions in regards to Well Test Satellite, please reach out to our support and we would be happy to help you. Thanks so much and have a great day.